Okay, I'm back again. This time you can see we got a lot of snow and all of my panels are completely covered. The ones at the bottom aren't even doing anything. Um, I'm going to dig those out in a little bit. But you can see the ones up at the top have some sunlight shining on them. Even though they're completely covered, they're still charging my batteries. Uh, there's 250 watts on the left. In the middle there's a 24 volt 20 watt panel. Uh, I've been down converting that to 12 volts and it's giving me about 10 watts. And the one at the very end is a 20 watt 12 volt panel. Um, that 24 volt panel, again, since it's being down converted, it's only giving me about 10 watts. It's working on this system and you can see uh, these batteries are fully charged. Um, whenever that light is green, that means the batteries have over 13 volts in them. Overnight, since they're pretty old, they do drain down to about 12.8, uh, 12.7. Uh, they got about 12.7 last night, um, and these have charged up to over 13 volts. So that's uh, pretty neat considering the amount of snow on those panels. Uh, the system here operates off of all the panels at the bottom, which are uh, 22 watts, and then the 20 watt panel I showed you at the end, and it's still charging. You know, when that left light is on, it means the panels are getting sunlight and it's initiating a charge. And then uh, finally, over here to the right, the 250 watt panels I mentioned, as soon as my camera will focus, uh, it's actually charging also. Uh, it's charging up the uh, main battery. And this is the one I also have the grids I hooked up to. It's initiating enough of, of a charge that, you know, it's recognizing it's getting input power. But of course, it will not uh, sync up and you know start sending power back into the grid uh, just before I start this video I had this USB charger in here and it's not enough wattage to um, to initiate a charge on this and in fact it brings all the other stuff down as soon as I can get it hooked up here you'll see the grid tie go off yep and you can see the green light on the USB charger starting but it won't charge any of these batteries and of course it brings the uh, charge controller down too. just disconnect that everything comes back on um, that's pretty much it I just want to show that you know even if there's snow outside say if this was a bad snowstorm um, you know it will still charge the batteries somewhat uh, we'll just top them off if they're full which they usually are since uh, most of my stuff is for uh, backup emergency power uh, you know, just top them off. Uh, but what I usually do, what I'm getting ready to do in a couple of minutes is to go outside and, you know, shovel my way out to the uh, deck and then clear off the panels and then I should get enough sunlight. So I just want to update you guys on that and I'll see you guys later. Peace.